Hello, you sweet sons of peaches. Hello you sweet sons of peaches, we are here with another video to do with voice changes, funny enough. The last video that I posted up had a ton of good feedback and a few questions and a few suggestions with a new video, so we thought we'd bring this one today, which is going to be based on actually our number one voice changer, which is Clownfish. And guys, yeah, let's get straight into the video. Also, if you haven't already followed, if you do enjoy the content or if you want to see the voice changer in action, make sure to go over to www.twitch.tv forward slash jugsrp and come and give us a little shout out. Um, so yeah, so Houndfish is my probably my favourite voice changer that you can get at the moment on Windows. It does also come with Mac. I know that was a few that was also questioned in the video. It does also come with Mac. I'm not 100% too sure how to do that as I am Windows based. But let's get straight into it and have a look how we set up the Clownfish ourselves. And I'll go through, there's like bugs and things like that. Um, that, you know, there's a few people that have said that the Clownfish didn't work first time. And I'll try and fix that for you. So here we have the Clownfish website. Um, if you go to download at the top right up here, uh, there will be a, a download button here and any plugins as well. Now, I don't use the soundboard, which probably should. Probably a good idea. I might look into that. But for now, I haven't used the soundboard. So maybe we'll do another video on that when I get that start work, when I start that working. But we do use the push to talk one as we do play a uh, role playing game. And push talk is something that, you know, I want to chat to the stream in my normal voice. Sorry. <clears throat> I want to chat to the stream in my normal voice. But I want to speak in game with my Lenny voice. So when you download this and the one of these, well, you will have on your screen this little thing which is the push to talk so you just set hot key i've got mine set as n which is my mouse key see that my mouse key so when i want to talk i just hold that down and it comes up with the voice changer just as so so as you guys can hear now we are speaking as Letty, which is the character which we play in uh divinity is rising Letty's getting low i'm sorry is this according right? to all sources the yeah. santos is place to go Okay. Because okay. tonight falls the first time. Just yeah. about half past six. Okay, and the first okay. time in history. It's gonna start raining, Lenny. It's raining, that... Lenny. Ha. Hallelujah. It's raining, Lenny. Yeah. Damn, bro, Amen. It's shit. raining, Lenny. Yeah, that's uh, one of the news. Oh, we got some cops here. Hello. And then I'll take off the key, and then we're back to normal. It's very fluid. It's very good. There's no sound delay, nothing like that. Really, I already said in the other video, really great piece of software. Um, and then you also have this, which is your, you know, where you can edit your the voice change that you want. So we have, I have mine set as just a custom pitch. So it's a minus two custom pitch. You can obviously go up and down with it. But if you go a little bit too far, it can sound a bit stupid. <coughs> sound a bit silly. <coughs> so if we use this now. We sound ridiculous. It's like deep as anything, and it's, uh, it's a bit stupid. Or if we go to the other end. And this sounds really stupid and ridiculous. And it, if you can hear it, it sounds like a voice changer. But if we go back to 2.0. Obviously, remember, you guys, you, you guys know what my um my voice already sounds like. So it's already, you're already going to be, your mind's already going to be deceived a little bit, thinking, what the hell was this guy's voice like this? So this is the one here. It's very fluid. A lot of people say when they first meet Lenny Game that they don't realise it's a voice changer, which is thumbs up. So you can add other things as well, like sound effects, or you can add a reverb, which is good. I like adding the reverb. Let's say I'm role playing, I'm in a church, and we're doing speech in a church um if i whack this on and then, then speak, speak you, you can, can hear, hear there's reverb it sounds like with a church which is really cool uh and then obviously there's other ones as well as like choir ghosts but these these sound a little bit silly uh they don't sound too bad too but, but you know, you know they don't they sound, sound great. great and then you got other one and then you got the other pitches here which is healing pitch these what i think these are is just um Pre, you know, uh, set up versions of the pitch, but maybe some of them aren't, because obviously this one's like reverse, I think. Hello, 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 hello. Everyone, you are some of the peaches. This one, mutation, mutation, mutation. Clone, as. Helium voice, baby pitch. This one's probably a cool one, radio. 
Right, goes or where's it going? Yeah, guys, as you can see, it's a very easy thing to set up. There's not much really to it. Now, there are a few bugs that I've noticed. When I first load up Clownfish, I use uh, my mic here is a Samsung G Track Pro and it is a USB mic. Sometimes when I open it up, I always check first. I go onto the here volume button. So if you go down here, this is where you can find your Clownfish. Uh, clownfish here, you right click on it and it comes up with a bunch of options here. To get this page up here, you click on set voice changer. Um, if you want to hear your microphone, you go to here. Um, so what I do when I first start up Clownfish or start up it in the day is I click on here microphone, uh, make sure I can hear myself in my Lenny voice. Um, if not, if I cannot hear myself in my Lenny voice, then what I usually do is I unplug my mic, um, close Clownfish after I've unplugged my mic, then reopen Clownfish, and then usually it works. There is obviously, there's probably, you know, if you're using a Go XLR or something like that, um, or an XLR mic, sorry, it's probably a little bit different. But with a USB mic, I'm sure most of you guys, there's a lot of you guys using USB mics. That's That's been a quick fix for me. Usually works 90 nine percent of the time first time um when i do that unplug um and close and open again uh it usually does do like when i load up clownfish i, I, I genuinely have that problem so it's like 98 80 90 percent of the time i'll load up clownfish and that problem will exist so hopefully that's a quick fish fix for you guys i know you guys were saying in the comments that um it, you know th it wasn't working there was problems no one was really specifying on the problems but that's been a problem for me and it's been a quick fix so hopefully that works on your side as well um in regards to to any other questions or anything like that make sure you leave a, a comment you know any comments down in the video or jump into my stream we'll actually be streaming in uh what time is it like 20 minutes so you know this video is going to be done after that but we have we stream every uh tuesday wednesday friday and sunday um around about 7 p.m bst 8 p.m bst sometimes early sometimes later but usually around that time for about six or seven hours so if you want to ask any questions be free to jump over over there and we I guarantee you will answer your questions to get over there the follow button <laughs> and also yeah guys if you do enjoy the YouTube video itself you know I'm trying to make these more the more of these videos anything you guys want I will make so leave a comment down in the section make sure you subscribe um give it a thumbs up and yeah if you have look anything guys anything anything regarding voice changes I've used them countless years um give me a shout you know on your phone if you need any voice change on your phone if you need any voice changes on Windows Mac I'm not 100% I've never used really used them I've never been a Mac kind of guy, so I'm not too sure with uh, regarding that. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching the video, and I hope you all have a great day, weekend, whatever day this gets uploaded. Um, and yeah, we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.